Today, let's take a look at how using and thinking about a tennis racket could help you with your golf game. I am not an expert in tennis, but as I bounce this ball on this tennis racket face, I'm thinking about it as a club face. Wherever this racket face is pointing is where the ball is going to go. Whoop, whoop, whoop. At least it's going to initially start that way, just like a golf ball will. Okay? So if we can learn to control our club face angle at impact, we can certainly control the direction that the ball is going to at least start. And then we can work with our swing path to figure out how the ball is going to curve. Okay, so really in golf, just like in tennis, in tennis, if this racket is facing up a little bit, that ball is going to start up and take off. So you know if you first start playing tennis, you end up kind of hitting those balls where you swing hard and maybe the racket's angled a little bit this way, boom, off that ball goes, you know, over the fence. I've been told that really good tennis players have a sense of how to control that club face along with the stroke, like their swing path, to get that ball to hit it hard and put a little spin on it to get that ball to rotate over the net. That's kind of the way that we hit a draw shot in golf, okay? So if we can kind of, look, okay, I'm gonna hit the wrong ball there. If we can tap into what we're trying to do in tennis, it just seems so obvious with that great big face, this is really small, okay? If we can learn to control that club face, then we're gonna be able to learn to control the golf ball. Uh, one thing that I will notice real quick is a lot of misconceptions people have, they feel like they, that club face should be on the target line, kind of straight back and straight through, and what that does is that almost always causes slices. The truth of it is, is just like in, in tennis, a tennis player, when they hit a shot, that, that racket rotates over, okay, really slow, it kind of rotates. Notice my weight's moving forward just like a golfer would, okay. In golf, we need that club face to rotate through as well. So what I like to do is we do a drill called the toe up to toe up drill where we keep track of okay the club is parallel to my target line now the toe is up and I hit a little shot toe up that way. Okay and you, what you can do is you can actually put yourself on video these new um, smartphones have a setting on them really slow motion for like 50 bucks you can buy a little adapter to put your phone on, an, on a uh, tripod and hit little shots toe up to toe up and that's going to help you get a sense of what you need to do to control that club face, okay? So I'm going to try it here, toe up to toe up. And sure enough, you can't see it, that ball's got a nice little draw to it. And when I finish that swing, the back of my club face, you know, is pointing over towards the camera. So think about tennis. Learn how to control that club face, and that's going to help you to hit much better golf shots.